It was early morning in the land of Crete, where children that are lost or run away come to sing, dance, and play. No one over six is allowed in Crete, for it's been said, and I've been told, that after six, you're just too old. And from Crete, you must stay far, far, far away. On the day six you meet, you must do a task for Crete. Little one turned six today, and he must fight or die in trade. Little one stood nine hands high, in your measure three foot five. There he stood proud and tall, waiting for Crete to call. In the arena, bold and black, stood the brave and mighty Elcat. There he stood, five feet ten, from the bottom of his hoof to the hair of his chin. Little one walked out from behind the stand, dressed in gold and laced in tan. Elcat charged from left and right. Little one was not an easy fight. Little one stood stern with his cape, making very narrow escapes. Elcat did not wait to recover. He drove in for another and another. Again and again, Elcat ran. Little one moving as fast as he can. Through the dust it could be seen, the red cape and little one's golden sheen. The dust settled and everyone saw that the red cape was no more. There the Elcat, strong and brave, lay cold and still, he could not be saved. Did the little one die? Is the great little one dead? Where has he gone with the cape of red? Two months later, I returned to Crete. All were silent, no one would speak. But rumor has it, and it's been said, that little one is alive and not dead. The law of Crete is as clear as gold. If you're over six, you're just too old. And from Crete you must stay away, at least forever.